Hello everyone, I'm Coach Kozak from Hasfit, and this is my upper body workout for beginners. This workout's great if you're just getting started in fitness, or maybe you've been out of it for a while and you're getting back into a fitness routine. This workout's great for both men and women, and only requires a pair of dumbbells. Most males will use between 5 and 12 pounds, or most females will use between 2 to 5 pounds. This workout can be done at home. I'm going to do the entire thing with you. I hope you're ready to start moving. Let's get to it. Okay, grab your dumbbells to start. We're going to get our feet shoulder width apart. A little weight back in our butt. Good posture. We're going to do 10 standing dumbbell shoulder presses. All the way up, all the way down. That's two, three, four. This is a great one. Five, six, not only for your shoulders, but your triceps. Eight, nine, ten. Okay, excellent. Next, we're going to do a dumbbell shrug. Great one for your upper back. Standing up straight, dumbbells at your side. We're just going to lift the traps straight up. One, two, three, four. Not a lot of range of motion in this one. Five, six, seven. Make sure you're not rounding. Eight, nine, and ten. Excellent. Okay, we're going to hit the ground for the next one. We're going to do a push up from the knees. If you can, you can do it from up top. But this is a beginner workout, so we're going to hit on our knees. Now, when you do a push up from your knees, a big mistake people make is to keep your butt way up in the air and then go like this. I don't want that. I want you to bring your hips down and take them with you. Elbows to a 90 degree angle and all the way back up. That's one. Two, three, don't forget to breathe, four, good job, five, six, seven, eight, we have two more, nine, keep fighting, and ten, very good. Staying on the ground, grab your dumbbells, we're going to lie flat on your back, this next one is for your tricep, which is the back of your arm. When you start with the dumbbell straight up and down, and now we're only going to bend at the elbow. And that will concentrate the movement and isolate the, the triceps. Only bend at the elbow. One, two, three, four. Breathe in on the way down, out on the way up. Five, six. Very good. Keep it up. Seven. Eight, nine, ten. Okay, back on your feet. Take the dumbbells with you. We got another arm movement coming up. Shoulders are square, shoulders are back. Good posture. We're just going to do a dumbbell curl. Nothing special. Just classic movement for your biceps. That's three. And on the way up, I want you to curl your pinkies in. Four and back down. Five. See how I'm curling my pinkies in? Six, good, keep it up. Seven, no swing, no getting your whole back into it. Eight, nine, one more, and ten. Okay, very good. Next, we're going to get a staggered stance, a little bend in both knees, and you're going to lean over upper body on a 45 degree angle. I want you to place one dumbbell and rest it here, and the other one we're going to roll with. And when we roll, I want you to pull back with your elbow. Two, three, four. So not with your hand, but with your elbow. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. One more. And ten. Good. Okay, we're going to switch it up. Do the other arm now. A little bend in both knees. Bend over. Back is straight still, though. And pull back with that elbow. One, two, three, four. Doing great. Keep it up. Five, six, only four more. Three, two, one, and zero. Good job. That's the end of the first round. All right, we're moving on to the second round. We're going back to that dumbbell standing shoulder press. Abs are tight. It's a good one also for your core, too. Ready? And one, 
two, keep that good posture the whole time, three, all the way up, all the way down, four, don't give me little half ones, five, six, seven, nice smooth pace, eight, breathe, nine, one more, 10, good. Dumbbells are down at your side, feet shoulder width, shoulders are back, we're gonna do the dumbbell shrugs, and I don't care what anybody tells you, no rolling the rotator cuffs. We're just gonna lift straight up. Ready, one, two, three, four, good. Five, that's halfway. Six, seven, only three more left. Eight, nine, and 10, excellent. Okay, we're going back to the ground. We're gonna do the push-ups. I know these are a hard one, but the truth is, this is just such a great movement, we can't ignore it. And you're only going to get better with these at time, in time. Okay, so again, but if you want to get better at them, you got to do them right. You can't give me these little ones. Try your best to get your elbows down to a 90 degree angle every time and bring your hips down. No butt up in the air. All right, let's do it. One, two, three. Really focus on your breathing. Six, keep it up. Seven, eight, all the way up, all the way down. Nine, and 10. Okay, very good. Grab the dumbbells, let's turn over to the back. Gonna work on the back of your arms now. Arms are straight up to start, and tricep extension only bending at the elbow. Let's get it started. One. Two, keep that elbow up the whole time. Three, four, you should have that elbow pointing to the ceiling when you get to the bottom. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more, and 10. Okay, excellent. Coming back up onto our feet, grab your dumbbells, taking them with you. Shoulders are back, I'm doing some more arms now, I'm getting into those curls. One, curl those pinkies in. Two, keep the shoulders back. Three, four, five, keep working through it. Six, seven, eight, nine, one more, and 10, good, okay. Now we're gonna get that staggered stance going. Remember, feet shoulder width apart, a little bend in both knees, upper body 45. Opposite dumbbell we're not using, we'll just rest here on your lap. And now let's pull back with our elbow. One, great one for your lats in the middle of your back. Three, four, five. We're getting every muscle in your upper body, six with this workout today. Seven, eight, Nine, nice and controlled, and 10, good. Mixing it up, next side. Resting on your lap, and pull back with that elbow. One, two, make sure you get a good angle here. Three, four, notice how my back is straight. Five, no slouch. Six, seven, you might even feel this in your legs a little bit. Eight, that's totally okay. Nine, and 10, good. Two rounds down, only one to go. Okay, last round. We're going back to the standing dumbbell shoulder press. Keep your abs nice and tight. Two, three, full range of motion. Four, all the way up. Five, yeah, it would be easier just to give a little half one, but don't do it. Seven, eight, nine, last one, 10, good. Okay, going into the dumbbell shrugs, shoulders are back, and straight up. One, two, three, great one for your traps. Four, five, really helps with your posture. Six, seven, eight, two more. Nine and ten. Okay. Last set of the push-ups, I promise. Come to the ground. Keeping your abs tight. Bring that butt down. Abs are tight. We're breathing. Here we go. One. Two. 
three, four, five, that's halfway, six, seven, nice depth, eight, nine, and last one for the day, ten, okay, good. Let's turn over to our backs, grab your dumbbells, and we're doing our last set of dumbbell tricep extensions. We're going to tighten up and tone the back of those arms. One, two, three, only bend at the elbow. Four, five, breathe in, breathe out. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, excellent. Okay, let's come back up to our feet. Last set of the curl, shoulders are back. And remember, no swing, only bending at the elbow. Pinkies curled in, one, two, three, four, five, halfway, six, seven, Eight, two more. Nine and ten. Okay. Almost done. Just gonna do our rows now. Feet staggered, little bend in both knees, good posture. And most important part, pull back with that elbow, not pulling up. One, two, three, four, five, six, last four, three, two, one, and zero. Okay, last 10 reps for this workout. Here we go, count them down. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, almost there, four, three, two, one, and zero. Excellent work, workout's done. All right, we're all done. I'm proud of you for sticking with this all the way through. Come back, repeat this workout often, and try to increase your resistance as you get stronger. And eventually, you can go ahead and move on to our intermediate workouts. If you did like this workout, make sure you check out Hasfit's website for hundreds of additional free workouts. We have our free meal plans to lose or gain weight. And we also have our complete 30 to 90 day fitness program. Everything there is free for you. Please do me a favor and subscribe to our YouTube channel so we can keep this great service free. Like us on our Facebook fan page for the best daily motivation sent right to your news feed. And while you're at it, support our service by picking up a t-shirt or a poster, anything to keep you on that road moving towards your goal. I'm Coach Kozak from Hasfit, and I'll see you at your next workout.